Multi day retreat right here in Montgomery got the future minds thinking coming up with solutions for agriculture, Alabama's billion dollar industry reporter Emma Ellis was there. Over the course of three days, students at the Shaping Equity Through Conservation Entrepreneurial Camp Retreat were challenged with coming up with a full business plan and presenting it to a panel of judges. Presidents of the AMPS Institute, which runs the retreat, James AMPS, says he wants to encourage students to be problem solvers and go-getters. We run entrepreneurship uh, retreats for young people ages 16 to 24. Uh, we help them to understand how to run a business and how to be more creative. And since we're sponsored by the USDA National Resource Conservation Service, we want them to solve an issue around agriculture. To get some background information before they started planning their business pitch, the Institute took students to several agricultural related businesses. When they returned, students were split up into teams of five to come up with their game plan. So when they come back, then they start processing how can they solve problems because at each of those places, they gave uh, ideas on what their challenges were. And so that's what they're trying to do. They come up and try to figure out how to solve some of those challenges. Entrepreneurial experience and mentorship aren't the only things that these students are receiving. There's also the chance to win some big bucks at the pitch competition. And so the first place is going to get 3,500. Second place is 2,500. Third is 1,000. One former retreat attendee says this camp has changed the trajectory of her life. I never thought I could do something like that. I never thought that I would be able to be a leader. I just didn't believe in myself like that. And after that, I was like, you know, I feel like I can do this. You know? Some students in the past have even gotten internships with the USDA from this retreat. Emma Ellis, WSFA 12 News. And a big congratulations to the first place winners of the pitch competition.